I'm down. Let's get it on. Spring Finals on the line. Showdown for the loser. And simple right at the belly of the beast. Into middle on the pistol. Smoke comes over top. Complexity trying to make this split happen. But it's going to have to be via way of 3v5. Not ideal. Beretta's player over here towards Fountain connects to Fang. And of course, we're going to have Simple try to run back through Storage Closet to try and come and help this. Bit doing an excellent job of serving up a distraction so that Navi can simply end this. Super easy. Yeah, I waited for the mid split to come in. So, is there anything that you didn't like about the last complexity showing we got out of Liquid that you think needs to be addressed moving forward? Think about it as we watch the SMGs absolutely own Electronic. That fourth kill. I, I, I mean, the, the Fang just disappears in store this evening. Simple on the scout awaits that peek out of Grim. JT obviously has been turned away already. Scout shot connects. Repeak will be punished. So a little bit of pressure falls on the low HP of NPL and Perfecto with just that MP9. You'd think the AKs could chew through. Rotate's coming over. Halzer gets the kill at a distance, makes that dark push way too easy. And Grim, quick as can be on that AK, just rocks Electronic on the rotate. So sure enough, they squeeze that sight and get right through. Coming through the attack right away. Skipping a couple of steps there, but trying to put some chaotic pressure on the site. And that actually, it didn't get them a kill, but it paid off later on when they had a low player holding on with two. Now, of course, unwatched for a second, so maybe Complexity still keep their guard up. Bad smoke inside of middle. Simple, gonna try to turn back towards Grim. Platform player, almost the double kill. Floppy barely standing. CT's trying to come over from Temple. Still smoked. Fang in between it all. And it's him versus NPL. You can see the CT on high alert that this pressure could be coming through because the connector push didn't happen. And Simple was waiting and ready. And if they don't send up somebody over here on lane, That's catch them off guard. Great use of Floppy watching that one other exit. Of course, Floppy 2 HP. So to no surprise, down he goes. Perfecto is going to get the flank of Halzard exposed unless the timing is Perfect, and so far, it's good. A duel at a distance, 10 seconds stick, and Perfecto, he'll be given the gift. NPL down to the wire. Oh, oh, oh he's Ooh, got it. Damn, and it was a really good defuse. Something quicker, perhaps? We got a lot of players here. Simple, oh, standing in the open while flash. Dark player, crossfire, but both get unraveled, and now complexity. Something quicker. I feel like, you know, we talk about what they did and didn't do versus Liquid. Sometimes it was that change of pace as well. Maybe they were maybe they were nervous in their Liquid game as well. Got some talks in. And instead, they get the best gun of the round shoved right into their faces. Yeah, confirmed. Two rifles sitting right on that exit. Another one dropped in middle. And just like that, any thought of heading elsewhere has been stopped. Electronics not going to let off this pressure. And the thing is, if they want to go back, to, going back to save, basically, because now the the guns they're assuming are going to get collected in this position, and they certainly will. Grim to be knocked over by a stiff breeze. Going to lock into Glizzy. It's a good crossfire here. Floppy on jail. First fight's going to be Perfecto versus Grim. And again, low HP, but Floppy peels one off. Gets the second. Oh, three. Floppy. Puts them in prison. Locked down on that A site. Yo, well done, Floppy. I think he's just waiting to peek this correctly. Let's see if he clears the ink. Oh, no. Oh, yep. The pathing's good. The pathing's perfect. Oh, the shot. Not so much, but it's recoverable. Could have been Floppy to peel away everything. Perfecto's going to get pressured from both sides. He would have heard that drop from Fang. Similar play. Complexity have done this before and trying to do it again. Nice transition, good damage. Similar situation to the last round. Fire on the feet of Simple burns him back. Cannot stop plant. Halzerk punches in those numbers. Bit flanking through the water. And Halzerk, just stay posted. You know Simple's here. There's that internal timing that somebody could be coming up from long. And now he's going to try to be concerned with that as well. Not the case. Fang peeks out, loses his face. And Halzerk, he's going to be split from both directions. Holds off, baited, no shot, waits, finally hits the elbow. Oh, it's a game of chicken. And Halzerk plucks up the 1v2. Hey, not bad. Another clutch for complexity. And it's another great start. 
Complexity standing up to these 5v4 situations. Doing great versus the B-side player specifically. Oh my god, is that his crosshair? He has to be trolling. What is the play here? Yeah, this, this Molly helps out a lot. They, they need to kind of move. Actually, Simple moves out the other way. Where are you going? Into the temple, they'll try their damnedest. JT does double back from that A play back into the late B. It's something fresh, but it's also kind of nasty. That just gets stopped every step of the way. Not the prettiest first attempt. Simple flashed. Oh, but bit. Up close, catches two. Just when that op shot misses, very real. Perfecto burned out from behind Glizzy. 20 HP, not ideal. Halzerk looking to clear close pillar, but it's behind default. Perfecto is waiting for his chance at impact. Grim's gonna clear him. Halzerk has to get out of dark and come up to plant this bomb, and unfortunately for him, he's out of teammates. Swaps out, no scope, lands. Poor guy, lands the no scope into the legs of NPL. That's what I was talking about. They smoke off connector and go for another temple wrap. NPL walks back in. Ooh, kind of caught off guard. Timing there works out, gives an M4 over. Interesting spots, they're getting through spawn. But again, 2-2 two, two to sites, though, so, yeah. When you're on this B site, and your flank becomes compromised, you just lean into dark. Peak canals, oh, it's all clear. You know you've got 10 seconds that it takes somebody to come running down. So another trade comes through. Halls are keeping the hopes of the B hit alive. Fang, late through temple. Back through temple. They're so confused. Brand new map, so hard to read these post plans. Look at the situation. What is this retake? Yeah, they have a smoke though, so it's gonna elicit the peak. Best I mean, gun here is Fang. It's a fake, they're waiting for the long play to come through. Now time's ticking pretty quick. Fang, he can line that up. Oh, we stopped it! But then Bit trades right back. Halzer oh. reveals that he's down on long, so Bit's gonna stick it the entire way, oh. unless... Oh! oh complexity! Yeah. They rob it! Oh, he's got him. Well done, Halzer. JT walked, so Halzer could run. Another clutch, a 1v2. We have two 1v2s, 1v3 in this game. And it's gonna run it back with this. <laughs> no, he did it with this. He did it with that crosshair. Oh, Again. Man, always with these 2K sprays. What a what a couple of kills here from Bit. Kind of avoiding simple catching these rotations. Perfecto will spot him finally. Grim's going in. Grim's going out. Now they just gotta clear the close right corner. NPL, however, running back quick. Can't come out wide. NPL. Ooh, it's just the one. JT to the clutch, shut down by Simple. So, bit three times in that half with at least two kills plus damage on long. Turns complexity away. Pro players often disagree. Just one for Grim. Alzirk's right there. Ooh. Oh, catches the player dropping. Has to keep fighting. No chance to really fall back there. Would have been left with like 20 HP, best case. JT trying to set up Fang, who's gone unchecked. Easy execute to the back of Electronic. Takes a gush in return. NPL needs to oh. clutch, but floppy? Skeet shooting. At that distance? Watch this second one. Oh! oh. Doesn't let his feet touch the ground. He's feeling good. Okay, and floppy changes it up. They're, they're testing him. Oh, nice oh. one. Nice and easy. Bit. Slices right through the A-hold. Perfecto catching JT elsewhere. Double connector push and only that deagle. Simple. Can he do it? Can he stop them? No. Back to the 3v3. Grim is under pressure. And he's cleared out by Perfecto. So B site open. But check out that bomb. The bomb is still on the steps of canals. Oh, this round's going to get weird. It's going to get stringy. Everybody's peeled in different directions. Electronic though, nice and easy. Comes creeping out from Temple and recovers the fact that Navi played with no bomb. Yeah, they played with no bomb. Ooh. A little bit low on grenades now. 
Grim with the one smoke of the round. He can smoke them out of the split if they go that way. I don't think this actually matters because they're going to be hitting the A site, it looks like. But they all leave again. They oh, all just fall away. They think it's going to oh, own. Off of that kill, they completely peel off of the A site, leaving only Floppy, who now knows there's a ton of pressure coming in. And Complexity, back to back rounds, have the idea, but pull off. Highest HP is simple here. 55 to work with. It's a slide out from Grim, shut down by Bit. Again, Complexity could have, and arguably should have, had they just stuck around. Another situation where they have an amazing response to what they've seen, where they lose. They're just so jittery in some of these mid-round moments, and now that bomb plant basically for free, except for Halzer, will contain control of that front connector play. They could chance the retake, it's man advantage. But you've got Simple. Yeah, that's right. Simple still just sat back leaning and holding on and hoping to counter his counterpart in Halzer. So he waits. And it's silent. Now that retake starts to come through. Utility coming out of complexity. Grim kills Simple nice and easy. But NPL with a double spray into heaven. Holds them back. Bomb critically ticking. Perfecto 1v3. Gets the first two and then just leans back. Perfecto. Did he get enough time? Oh, did he do it? 1v3? Oh, he oh. did! Oh my god. Bank took an extra second to get on that bomb. I think he has a defuse. Getting shot in his foot as he looked into the wall and just tried to get out of there. Another gut-wrenching round for complexity to have to try to stomach. Navi on fire with a lead. That bomb is coming back in this direction. Here's that B main information. Yeah. Uh oh. But oh, just yeah, like that. It and the full commit, man. It's 5v3. Halzerk, eyes on middle bridge. Silver lining will be holding on to these three guns. Make it two. Navi, they're not going to let off the throttle. No chance. Mid players coming to split this. So complexity on the brink of being bottomed out as Navi take 14. That much guaranteed. Halzerk a chance to escape. And he'll get that. NPL chases deep, but no, can't keep it. It's one AWP. That's it. Well, look at this clash. So many members yeah. of both teams ready to fight mid. I mean, if the op takes the long one, pistols can prevail versus Perfecto. Oh, oh. and Halzerk, he gets the close kill. Pop out of the 5-7. Fang onto the AK. But Bit draws it back. 40 seconds. Bomb on simple, and so many bodies spotted on dark that the mid to A would work out well. Boppy can feel this split coming in his direction. Complexity trying their absolute damnedest to keep this one alive. Floppy under pressure, both sides of this. Simple doubles back towards mid, gets clipped by his counterpart, and so that AWP will find three kills on the round and then stops that bomb from progressing down into the A site. And so, Navi's streak will come to an end. It feels like finally for complexity. And JT, if he's not careful, he's gonna get pounced on. Grim trying to hold long. Great flash, oh wait, it's from Simple. Makes things weird. CTs, hang on. JT able to get away from Dark and add to the tally of kills. They're stuffed on the approach. JT, time to shine. Triple for him and complexity 13. That was pure substance from JT. You love that. But they're going to go ahead, get aggressive, trying to play it active. Yeah, this is post clear. Like, Bit already got into this spot, so an 35. interesting position. Oh, but Bit, every time, every time there's a duel, no matter which side of that doorway he's on, it is headshot after headshot. And Perfecto picks one up on the other end of this map. But it's still going to be the A split. And every defender from complexity is dead. One after another. All empty-handed. Navi have taken 15. They fall like a house of cards in those final moments. They had the right idea about every single peak, and they win none of the duels. We can talk about the improvement out of Complexity's individuals all day long, but in this 29th round, it is all of them empty-handed. And with that, Navi, a chance to close. That one's tough to talk about. And Complexity try to keep them honest. They're really good at reading pressure. I think this comes down to Bits comms. Simple starts dropping the nades. Oh my god. Fang. Oh, he turns it back. 
He almost let him die, but can they still get out through main? Floppy spotted bodies, but he gets hard clear. Op shot out of Halzerk. It's gonna be a 2v4 post plant with damage versus two. And Bit, the soul crusher of round 30, perhaps. They're gonna press oh. in. They're not gonna hide. They're gonna take this fight to complexity. They actually took a risk here. They're open to be main, but this risk actually might pay off. Could work. First kills his, second in for simple. Now it's Bit's chance. He needs a double. He gets that first on Halzerk, runs away. Fang looking for his third on the round just to get to OT. He's on top of the bomb, sticking it, but Bit doesn't give a damn. Round 30, and Navi will survive this test. Multiple instances that Complexity could have robbed away rounds. Excellent forethought, but also indecision. And that crept in. A heartbreaking loss for Cole. Floppy is the second player here under Valk, I believe. Yeah, Halzerk's the other. And Halzerk was kind of baiting them into that fight, but no kills just yet. PL is going to pick one up. 2v5 here on the A site. Far rotations over on B. Bobby hears him running in. Kills Electronic first. But then both the defenders go down and Navi have gone ahead and milked this one down to the yeah. final few seconds. But it's all good. Ain't no chance JT and Grim are coming through with this retake. Not with Simple down deep. He'll connect to Grim with the P250. And just like that, Navi are going to find Pistol on the T side of Inferno. Kind of need to do something else after Halzerk died inside of Halls. Of course, didn't work out the way they wanted with uh, SDY. But MPL may be much more malleable, you know, yeah. with not any experience. Ooh, they take a risk in playing retake, but Grim puts up the first frag. Moves it back around towards Coffin. We've got a 5v3 here. Bit attempts to press out middle on his own. Electronic just wants that bomb plant at this point. I understand why. Make complexity come to you. That's now three players, four players looking to go through construction. And here it comes. Retake attempt. Fang and Grim kill a piece. Simple on the new box. Tapping away. And it's all good here for complexity. Opening kills both sides of the map into a very fluid retake. Yeah, first impression is that they're, they're probably going to take the banana control and try to well, put a lot of pressure on this side of the map in this half. Back to find him. Oh, nope, too far down beneath him. Actually, bounce just in front, so bad nade, but good trades. Good enough to put Electronic in a clutch. There's maximum pressure on the rotators. No one's in early. Tap him. Yeah. Respected him right there. No dice. Doubles back around construction. They're running in. He's ready for the fights. But Floppy's got the trade frag. So two kills in this one for Floppy. Him and Halzerk still going. Complexity. Losses don't help. Floppy off. Sandbags. Clean two kills. Shuts them down. The fact simple comes around the corner for the trade and is met by the headshot. This could be exactly what they need. 5-7 up next. Bit and NPL, though, peeling players off the A site. Grim's Fomus could make the difference, because NPL's so low that he wants Electronic to be a part of this push. NPL, if he chances this too much, rounds that extra corner. Could be cleared out. Electronic will be pushed into the playmaker's position. Rounds the moto and sprays. Tries to go in for the multi-frag. Smoke ahead of NPL. Nade thrown out. Over box. Lines up one. Doesn't know. Grim almost snapped onto. It's the USP needed to keep Cole alive. Gotta appreciate NPL's mechanics, though. Like, nearly locked that up. But Grim, that headshot saves it. Close call. It's minimal. JT primed to get aggressive. But as he walks up along the wall, Tech9 finds the headshot. We've got a player new box and Halzerk on coffins. Grim. Damn, man, they don't know about the construction wrap. Now everybody else can just pause. Halzerk still playing because he doesn't know. Grim's able to answer back. Does a ton of damage to the other players coming through. Can Floppy be the difference maker? Those rifles getting picked up on the back site. And Navi making the most out of a bad round because Electronic wraps it through construction and unravels the complexity setup. They had nothing to lose. They, they were the ones who came in with low guns. Oh, 
Nothing saved either. So, Navi, that's going to be a little bonus. Yeah, they're going to punish that one. They get a player deep onto tree. Grim knows he's in a world of hurt, but still holds on. Oh my god. Simple's gone way deeper. Fang seems cautious on the approach, but loses his head. And Simple's still so deep. Grim will bring it back. So nobody's actually inside B. What's even happening right now? Why would the bomb be back in, in T spawn after a situation like this? Floppy, how's he going to use it? They're not coming in from bananas, you would think. Two players already about to cross. Bit's got a teammate on the same angle. Good trade. Electronic gets the double, but there's still life on this. And that nade, immense. 40 damage, and Floppy will move through. Now, they came in with no kit, but that's fine. Of all the shortcomings that Complexity had, things aren't comfortable here for Navi. 15 seconds to spare. Flashes find their mark. Bomb hits the ground. Simple clears one, and NPL. It's a multi-kill round. Denied. Grim tries to push out through Moto, and JT, all that damage that happened on Banana, is now going to keep him back from this. Simple presses outwards, he knows what he wants, and he gets it as he pleases. Fifth for Navi, as that crunch through the A site pays off. This one's looking like it's got some pace. Oh, Halzerk and Floppy caught going for the boost, but still ready for that early fight. May seem like nothing, but Perfecto. Given a chance to challenge that smoke. Now it's a waiting game. They'll go for the boost. Red by JT, but one by NPL. And there's more where that came from. A couple more CTs. One over on the cross. Bomb dropped and complexity. Just kind of bait and switch out JT. And bit nowhere to be found on that push. Bomb delivered to the B site. Have been in order. All the timings are looking really solid here for complexity. When they went for the retake. When they for went control of the A site. How they, even with a good start, they decided to put just the right amount of pressure. And, well, Bit gets a kill. He's just really testing this after time for some reason. Down to 35 seconds is Navi. No, PL. Navi don't have any smokes. Challenging this. Fang emerges. And with a back turned, Halzerk. Stuffs NPL. Then Electronic activates with the bomb nearby. Grim, top box, draws in. Navi's commitment? Yes. It's a flashback out from Perfecto. I mean, he has to get this kill, and the Molly could have made the difference, but Grim stands tall. Simple. Seven seconds. And unfortunately here for Navi, this one's gonna fizzle out. Grim holds his own, and with a look of confusion, he'll send Navi into their CT side. I would agree with all of that. And I think that obviously Grim going back to what he has been throughout this event, top fragging clearly. Yeah. The heaviest hitter so far for complexity. But we've met his counterpart, Electronic, toppling a couple of players towards Banana. This is just going to force Bomb up and over into A. And of course, it can be recovered here for complexity, but it's going to be, need to be clean ones. First one found by Floppy, but extended fight versus NPL, he almost gets away. Fang with the homing missile of a Glock shot to catch him on the fallback. Now we're talking 2v2. Fang can just stay inside of pit. Halzerk a little concerned. Oh, but it's clean. A one tap into electronic and a 3v5 made possible here from complexity. They just need one more kill. Perfecto oh. down as Halzerk catches a couple, just like Fang between the two of them, four. Still 2v5 here on the site, a Deagle here on Perfecto. The two pistol players, right? They went in onto A with the guns. Desert Eagle, good for one. Electronic, gonna have to do it. And he Ooh. will find Floppy's face. NPL, getting over with that Fomus. Quicker rotate this time. Electronic, tough duel with that 5-7. Little health to do it with. Flash comes over from Banana Halzerk. Nice clean headshot. Grim, he's gone on spotted and almost given the chance. But Electronic gets on top of Bomb. Is it too late? Wow, this comes down to the wire. Looks like he's got it, but oh, it's, this gets good. Is extremely oh, close. Oh my not. gosh. Oh, it is. But it is. But it's not. But it is. <laughs> okay. End scene. Here and uh, the two B players are far from getting over. This could come down to MPL. Maybe simple as well. Lance's shot. Fang hangs on. Then dropped by the second. Up 
quick on the cycle, but there is a curious moment here. Grim gets into the arch, and just that bit of cover lets him come back with a free headshot. Sight players gonna have to do this on their own. Bit stays tucked, Moto Smoke goes down. 15 seconds. Grim hitting the bomb site gets NPL to Bowser? fire off, and nothing, nothing out of the rest of the defense because Grim gets into Arch. It all gets unraveled. Pauses for a moment and jackknifes this Arch wrap. Yeah, and I'll say it again. This is why I don't like Navi CT side because they play like they have good enough players to win, you know, rounds versus great teams gambling. But again, he still hasn't left Arch, still hasn't moved a muscle. Putting a lot of pressure on Perfecto and Electronic. And here comes the commitment. Top box traded, and Perfecto now just tucks into the second orange, tries to go back. And of course, there's a gap on that smoke, but no shot out of Simple. Halzerk's gonna plant inside, covered. If they continue to play this slowly, Floppy will find his timing. And therefore, complexity on 13. Simple, stoic like a golem just stuck in the mud back on spawn. And now these CTs are gonna get wrapped from both ends. So complexity, not only pushing through that bomb site, but a nice, calm, collected play from Ricky Camaro to give complexity that four round lead. Either way, the full flank from Electronic. It's a good amount of activity. And Electronic sprays away for the second one. So poor complexity realized that they have been red. And that's the rest of Navi are on high alert. It would take a miracle, you'd think, to get through this. A miracle by name of Floppy. Grim's gonna go ahead and plant this. This is winnable, but Bit's still inside of the pit. So it's a thorn in the side of Complexity's post plant. Smoke towards Moto. Massive gap though. And so Simple about to join his teammates. Grim gonna lose his duel versus Bit. That second player towards Pit should be enough. Should be. Enough to get this going. Fang empty-handed on the fall, and as it should have always been with Electronic on such high alert and Navi in position, that's double digits. You know, big head-turning moments. And wasn't it 14-10 Inferno where they actually lost? Yep. This exact score, I believe, that FaZe came back from. Navi trying, but Grim has decided otherwise. Electronic has been good, but Grim has been great. And just like that, it's a challenge in through Coffin and construction by trying to take Anubis versus top tier competition. We've seen excellent calls out of JT, even though a little uncertainty kind of crept in on that first map and could have cost complexity the rounds that would have otherwise made this, by the looks of it, a 2-0. No, oh, Molly correctly. Oh, the shot's in. Nice lands. And then it's perfect for Electronic to just pounce on the moment. Nice one and two. Navi, 5v4. However, it's a very quick aggression out of complexity. They had the pieces in for this A split, but bit and pit. Who else to just shut down complexity on the approach? Again, five attempts. No one said this was going to be easy. Halzerk with a little recovery. And now JT, far too much to ask. Bit goes big. Yeah, it was fantastic over on Anubis, and that was a great pit hold as well. It's what it is. Every round winnable. They've got Simple off the first angle. Pistols out. Teammates near him. Oh, it should have been easy, but Halzer can floppy with a kill apiece. Perfecto also dies to Grim. Maybe that's why they had smiles on their faces. Grim oh, can run they have, to B. Yeah, they have two players stuck in the A site, and they're actually scared to rotate. They need to move fast. This is how it could all end, no. potentially on an eco. We've got no armor on JT, and the bomb is going to get planted in an open site. A worrying moment, but we know what JT's Deagle can do. Oh! Unsuspecting killer comes around the side, and it has to be NPL. He who should not have to keep a team like Navi alive, but here he is. 1v2, peek out from Grimm, and it's done. Complexity fighting for this chance at the spring finals. Navi take their beating lying down, and some of those rounds just so uninspired. Some of those setups flat and complexity with fighting spirit. Beating up evil geniuses 16 to 8 and clearly in the best form so far here in groups. Oh my god, it's horrendous. <laughs> Electronic at least able to recover. Simple right there with him.
Okay, we'll let it slide. We'll let it go. But obviously, Complexity just as frustrated that they don't pick up that kill. Guess who's here? Simple, three kills. But guess who's also next? It's Grim. He shuts down Simple. He knows Electronic's here. There's no support for Electronic yet, but Electronic keeps his head tucked yeah. and keeps the hopes high. That is exactly what you need. Three out of Simple, two out of Electronic, a full house from the heavy hitters. Yeah, I guess they're looking to get it together now. And yeah, Simple, oh, you know, these past two maps, not great. His groups performances on average not great even though we had one like kind of outrageous performance out of him looks like they're rearing to try it again actually two missed shots out of him so far Paul Zerk nice first deagle and floppy's mp9 racks up a second kill simple chance to shine here but didn't expect that floppy drops him right into the bit play yeah we've got the bomb kind of lagging in this position but bit on full hp and the good gun so worried about the flank so they can't go for that default plant on dice grim could charge through that smoke bits attention turned at least the bomb goes down bit with a chance to recover looking for the third on this one but it's grim again and this time just 1v1 nice from bit oh. patient waits and it pays off yeah use the plume of the smoke and again at least for, for navi it's almost all about the individuals that have put together good rounds because there have been some good plays here and there. Are these crosshairs real? I mean, I, I, they're I, actually I, sticking to them. If it works, they'll I look like God. So. I refuse to believe it. All right, fast one. Floppy, M4. Ooh, maybe expecting... I mean, look at the amount of MAC-10s we had. Navi thought this was going to go down easy. Complexity, so well-equipped and so far ahead of this push out of Navi. There's no way that this Haymaker didn't just catch them off guard. And Simple, oh Lord, he sees them all. <laughs> <laughs> Grim turns around oh. like, what's that? Oh. All that matters. Decides to slide it back. We've got four players from Navi on the short side. Oh, Simple, incredibly clean, floppy. He's got a teammate right there with him. It's a bit of a bait and switch, but he gets nothing. Grim slides up the one man army, double kill. Saw Perfecto goes for the short play and Heaven also falters. Oh. So complexity with the pieces in the right position, but Navi hit the shot. It somehow, just from that perspective, it looked like they were winning that round. Again, we don't want to see kids come into play, but they're playing to defend the sites. Collateral. Halzerk, one kill, but immense amounts of damage. And there's a single smoke here for Navi. So queue up the freebie to Floppy. And no damage done, essentially. Well done on the opening tactic. Navi, they're shut out of this. I don't know if they're going to go through. They're going to try. Yeah. It's desperate. And it stinks. So there we have it. Halzerk rewarded for that quick intuition. Change position. Go. Yeah, that's solid. I mean, yeah, opening tactic. Lots of movement from him as an opper into teammates that can help put up a hold and complexity to keep it competitive. Solid round. So here's how they try to make up for it. Quickly, potentially, into the B site. Running around, scrambling to get this exec in order. It could work, but Grim doesn't have to worry about Monster. He can just fixate here on short. Hauser takes down the first one, and Grim goes ahead. Body bags a double. Simple 1v5, and the first kill is in. Close left player and floppy hears him coming. Everybody on high alert. Everybody coming deeper in and the flash. But simple still hunts. Oh, oh. Nice kill onto Halzerk. But the problem here for we simple. Exactly. Took some damage back. Here he is at 20 seconds. Bomb still in possession. Floppy tucked on short. Two players there. And just as simple starts to size up things. Flash over. Halzer tucks, drops off, but there's the pop-up. Fang can't manage that second. And Bit knows he's pinned in, but JT picks up the kill mm. into connector. Big yeah. find. Yeah, it's a push-pull play here, and JT last time got shut out. Oh, perfecto, they're coming right into him, oh. and it's great. JT, another two. And sometimes it's an after-image flash just because of how far and long, uh, long that area is, of course. So, but we look back again over towards B. Oh, what? Damn. Right, because we're watching it from Perfecto, so I just assumed Jesus. Electronics right behind him. Just feels like complexity or keeping things fresh. Yeah, love seeing these new setups over and over again. Constant changes, preparation clear. Oh, and Fang. There's a bomb at the top of that ladder if he really goes deep. And then the short players, they come into the short side of water just to exchange kills. Because Navi, it's either from party or through short. And complexity, eyes above. 
a push beneath, a 4v3, but taken back by Electronic. Fang has gone deep on this commitment. Simple awaits him. But the middle of map control right now, like Fang can even take this open position. He now turns his attention backwards. Oh, walks to the ladder. Simple. Great patience. Well, that's a reward. Electronic just outside the wall. Yeah, really depends where he's going to look. Oh, what a shot. But now Grim knows. 15 seconds. Listen, man, he's in the pocket, and he's been playing out of this world. Short players coming up. They know he's here now. Five seconds to spare. Somebody's hands will be busy, and Electronic makes sure to get him from above. Put an end to that hope there. Navi, really nice slowdown. But if they get close to the site, they're not, they're not going to lose it. Oh, oh a nice God. flash. The flash is perfect. Good thing Grim was there. Well, this makes it a 3v3. There was no plan to attack there. Halzer knows now. It's his chance, and he nails the first one. Bit and bomb goes down. We've got NPL front facing from bathrooms. Halzerk, a missed second shot is going to allow for Navi to keep moving forward. But guess what? Grim's in position. B, A, doesn't matter. He finds his footing and he just sinks in. Perfecto with a clutch attempt. He's got a smoke. If maybe that becomes important, but right now he just wants that kill. And Grim's not giving it to him. Bank peak predicted. But Grim goes wide. Complexity three round lead. And that op could pull all the attention away. The fact Grim picks up the kill towards Short's huge. Fang regains vision, but doesn't get either. It's a bunch of damage. It could still queue up another member of Complexity, but it felt like he had both. Yeah, and the damage might matter. It's 3v4, but they are so low. Perfecto, will he get cleared in this spot? JT is looking for it. Lesser weapon, but still comes out on top of it. Still locked into this spot. This is actually still not over. Floppy. And Grim does get back fast enough to just have to worry about Banks. Simple 92 HP, the guy who has to go big here. But Grim pushes out. It's a ton of damage though, so it looks like Navi full control of the situation. Now suddenly Simple has this massive advantage. Grim, can he kill his teammates first? Not even needed. It's a sixth one from Navi. It's one half away from these teams going to finals or that showdown. Some really nice awareness in the slower mid-round moments. But complexity. Oh! Floppy! No way! With the P250. There's a retake inbound here from Navi. Perfecto wants to come and join them through connector. And they're gonna give that flash over to NPL to try and support the push. Halzer, if he can keep them in, then all good. If oh he my can God. delay that, even better. Fang decides he chooses violence, and it is P250 kills across the board for complexity. You actually can't lose after a kill like that, right? I mean, how could you let your teammate down? Floppy jumping P250 Muertos across the sky. Oh, my God. No. Oh. Wow, he wasn't even pre-aiming it. Oh. That was just a regular floppy reaction. That's your oh. average floppy kill right there. Oh my god, if that sets the tone for this half. <laughs> Jesus. Listen, you know they just sent a shiver down Complexity's spine. Do not sleep on the talent. NPL. Pressure's here. But he shuts down Floppy. And then that flash finds its home. Electronic double kill. Thomas takes the place. JT 1v3. Yeah, that mow down, man. That was beautiful from Electronic. That's what Navi need. Just a quick stop yes. to an attempt in from Complexity. It's going to take more than that. And we've got mirrored attacks. We had Complexity. But Complexity numbers outside this bomb site. MPL was hit low. And still able to stop JT, who's been good with the kills at the moment. Grim. Oh, clean. No. Double headshot trade. Smoke onto the short side, but that tells Grim there's a CT deep graffiti. Yes, they know that. Duck on the left side. Bomb's coming out the middle. These smokes are so weird. It missed slightly. Oh, that's a weird gap. But it's no equally weird banks. for the CTs. 3v3 retake. They're trying to creep up. No telling who wins this. Oh, it's simple. To make the difference, at least versus Halzerk. And then Perfecto just climbs onto the wood. They've got support in from heaven. Grim, He's not fourth. done. All four so far. And now his bit tries to chase him. He just falls back. Back and around onto the short side. Complexity chewing through all those guns that were saved. And it's Grim to just keep himself tucked back. Bit off the defuse. Nothing shown. Grim shrouded in secrecy. A slash with the scythe and they're down. 
a shining moment for the kid after 30 kills on Inferno. And maybe a chance for Complexity to win a series behind it of this stature, of this magnitude. After talking about a team who could take down top teams, who came close, but never actually completed it. This one might not be in vain. Of getting kicked off Liquid, hearing your teammates tell you that you didn't have what it takes. Well, now who's locking in a spot in Washington? Now who's topping the boards versus the likes of Navi? Simple, trying his best. Floppy, Fang, invigorated by this performance. And that will be 14 for Cole. Oh, it's so quick. It's so easy. It's 14-8, map three. But this, this is a powerful looking complexity. Good individual level out of Floppy this round. Good individual level out of Floppy this series. But NA knows it's not over till it's over. Floppy gonna make quick work of Perfecto. Oh, and Perfecto's just been bullied off that B site. Victim of the double nades. This time Floppy opens and bit a clean couple of headshots and a chance to just evacuate. Fang's getting ever closer on long. And that smoke's gonna let him get real close. Floppy's dinked. Oh. Simple's worried. And with good reason, there is still a chance that they cut through this site. Fang getting real close. He can smell Simple. Simple connects his shot, but Fang pounces on the play. If Floppy can just plant this bomb, then Fang can come in big. But NPL's nade spreads just far enough. An automatic, excuse me, oh electronic. <laughs> I've got NA on the brain. Oh, comes in. Simple still up in the bathrooms. Electronic on an op. op. Yep. Two ops in this play. And if he gets that deep angle, I mean NP. Oh! <gasps> Double deep and a bit more wall bang damage. They see him running back. He sticks around. Whoa. And this double op setup, pushing Simple into the pocket the moment they make contact. That door swings, but he shoots first. JT survives, but that's due to activate Electronic. NPL shuts down on the other end, and Complexity have met their makers. Wow. 3v5 by way of double op. Well, you, you called him automatic, and then he picks up the op. I don't know what's happening, but I don't think they do either. What is this? The most unlikely cameo through the kneecaps. And he instantly gets a collateral. Listen, there was a critical round on Inferno the complexity managed with just this type of buy. But bomb stops and every kill comes in clean. Perfection from Navi's A-hole. Yes, another full house between the two. The second of this half so far on the Ecos, but... Simple, we have not seen him here. Flash comes in, fully blind. He's dead, surely. Floppy, oh, stopped just like Grim. Look at that sea of fire. Bomb thrown down in the open. Smoke comes right after. The two players for Complexity who are above 20 kills. Somebody else has to pick up this slack. If they're gonna fight for this bomb, they walk inwards and Fang sent down. Hauserk, quick D. The short player, closer. And it's JT. But now there's an AK here for Hulzerk. CT's getting stringy, but CT's lock this in and find themselves on fire. Remarkable moves from MPL quietly here off the corner of Monster. From 14-8 to a near tied game. It's gonna be fast. Simple under pressure. Simple, oh, no scope to start. Survives a little longer, gives electronic runway. Trade frags back and forth. Navi top of the fight. But an M4 acquired by Halzerk, and if they're fast enough, they can get away from that fountain play. But bomb plant stopped. Desperation sinks into the heart of Halzerk, and doubt into the minds of complexity. Fang gives away the angle. Not known to op, and not known to do much now. Navi tie this game. Six straight, 14 all. Simple looms near. Oh, this should be a difficult site to take. Oh my god. But two showing themselves on Holy short. Hell. And they pull the rotation from Simple off the A site. 30 seconds. Bit didn't see it. Oh, or did he? I don't know. They're trying to move back. Simple's trying to figure out the comms. They're stuttering. They're stalling. And yet Simple walling them. That first kill's his. Fang returns the favor. We've got that push up from Dice. Bomb out. Hauserk 
not ready for those fights. They thought with simple, things would go down easy, but we are talking about Na'Vi with seven rounds straight. 31st for Na'Vi. I can't believe it. After the lead that Complexity had again, and they falter near the finish line, and this one is organized so perfectly. Simple on the pillar covers NPL. Eyes towards short with JT on the brink of this bomb site hit. Oh, a missed shot. Simple dives back into the cover. Now he's lost his teammate, but he can do this on his own. Deagle out. Down goes Halzerk. And so does Simple. They've cracked open that bomb site, which means the plant is theirs for now. Smoke, flash, and a half health fang with bit and electronic on the retake. A missed smoke. They can't afford these mistakes. Not like this, not now. The last hope for NA. Two teams already at the showdown and Complexity will join them. When you come for the Kings, you best not miss. The hopes and dreams of Complexity shot dead in the street. As Na'Vi do it, they pull it out in 30 rounds. On a map, they had no business doing anything but maybe getting to overtime. Unbelievable.